Hey everybody, we're playing Black Myth Wukong and we're working on accessing a secret area in Chapter 1. We're hit the outside the forest incense checkpoint. Now this one's a little tricky because you do have to progress into Chapter 2 and then backtrack to Chapter 1. But I'm going to walk you guys all the way through it. So from this incense, if you head up here to the right hand side, we have to defeat this boss here because he gives us a spirit that's going to give us a special ability to access an area in Chapter 2. You will need to progress through Chapter 1 to an NPC who provides you with guidance in your gourd. This allows you to actually pick up the spirits and then you can use the special ability that's acquired through defeating the enemy and acquiring their spirit. So once you have this spirit here though, the Wandering White, you're going to go into equipment, you're going to select that spirit. If you need to, just make sure you rest at an incense and you can replenish that spirit's ability. But we're going to rest here at the Valley of Despair. This is in Chapter 2. Now, there are a couple of ways to get to the area that we're going to get to to use this ability. But essentially, all you need to know is you need to progress through Chapter 2 to the first Prince boss. So it's like this giant rat boss. I'll show you what I'm talking about once we get over here. But we're pushing through and just going to drop down inside here. Now, this should look familiar to you. This is what the boss looks like, though. Okay, so if you recall the first Prince of the Flowing Sands boss, after you defeat him, you can actually turn around and there's a wall just behind you. Head over to the wall and with our Charge Spirit ability, we're going to use that ability on this wall right here. It's going to create a gap that we can slide through. Now, once we get into this little cave area, there's not much to do inside this area except collect what's in a chest on the opposite side of the room. We're then going to take this item back to Chapter 1, and it's going to help us unlock the secret area in Chapter 1. So the scales inside the chest here are what we want. We're going to take these scales back to Chapter 1 with us. It's going to help us unlock the secret area. We're actually going to go back to outside the forest, the same incense we were at when we defeated the spirited boss. And I'm just going to speed this up for you guys. There are some enemies throughout this area. I went ahead and just cleared this out for convenience so you can see exactly where we're headed. But we're going to head down inside here and we want to make our way to a waterfall over here. With this scales item that we have, we can examine the waterfall and it's going to allow us to enter the waterfall now. Inside the secret area is a boss fight, so good luck with that. But hopefully it's helped you guys out. Thanks for watching and we will catch you next time.